NATO allies have supported Ukraine for many years, and especially since uh, Russia invaded uh, Ukraine for the first time back in 2014. And uh, NATO allies uh, uh, like the United Kingdom, the United States, uh, Canada have uh, also helped to train tens of thousands of Ukrainian forces, uh, special operation forces and older troops. And they are now uh, bravely fighting um, and resisting the invading Russian forces. Uh, and I think this support over many years has proven extremely important uh, in uh, strengthening the Ukrainian armed forces, and Ukrainian armed forces are much bigger, much stronger, much better equipped, much better trained now than in 2014. Uh, uh, and I'm glad that NATO allies have helped to achieve that uh, with the training and with the equipment. Then, of course, it's first and foremost the courage uh, of the Ukrainian armed forces and the Ukrainian people and the Ukrainian political leadership that has actually enabled them to fight back, uh, to slow down, to resist the brutal invasion uh, conducted by the Russian Federation and, uh, and which is a responsibility of President uh, Putin. Uh, and it is President Putin who is responsible for this war. He can end this war now, withdraw all his troops now, and then engage in good faith in a, uh, in a political effort to find a diplomatic uh, solution. So we are calling on President Putin to do exactly uh, that. Um, um, uh, th then NATO's uh, Ukraine is a, is a highly valued uh, partner uh, which we have supported and continue to support and allies are also stepping up support partly with military equipment, uh, partly with uh, financial support, humanitarian support but also by uh, imposing the sanctions which is uh, forcing uh, uh, which is actually crippling uh, Russian uh, economy. Uh, our, our, our responsibility as an alliance is to protect and, and, and defend all allies, and we are sending a clear message that uh, we are ready to do so by increasing the presence in the eastern part of the alliance. But again, it is Russia and President Putin that are uh, responsible for the invasion of Ukraine, and uh, President Putin should end this senseless war by withdrawing its uh, forces from Ukraine.